boys. Our queen has arrived. Seraphine, the brand new champion. We're going to be playing her as a support because I'm pretty sure she's going to be a dang good support. So as you can see, here she is. Just dancing on into lane. So we're going to be running Summon Airy, Mana Flow Band, Absolute Focus, Scorch, Legend Tenacity, Presence of Mind. But guys, let me know what you think about the new champion down in the comments. This is the world premiere. She literally just came out like 10 seconds ago. So there's her Q. As you can see, my passive is uh, underneath my health bar. When I've got my third spell, it echoes. So I'm actually, next time I use my Q, it's actually going to use it twice. So my Q is going to be my poke. It is a skill shot. My W is going to be my surround sound, which is uh, movement speed and a shield. And if they're already shielded, it's going to be a heal. So we'll show you we'll, we'll show you what Seraphine's uh, laning looks like, guys. All right, so my Q is my poke, W is my heal, speed up, and shield. Wow, that's actually so much utility in one spell. And then my E is slow, and if they're already slowed, it roots them instead. So Seraphine Ash is going to be a god tier lane because uh, they're always going to be slow if Ash can hit them. Alright, let's, let's see what our poke looks like, guys. Boing, boing. We'll kind of, like, throw it over the minion wave. Okay, so we can... That, that's pretty good, though. We can actually harass over minions. Boink. Big ol' AoE. It's, it's kind of weird seeing her move around. She's almost like on a mobility scooter or something, guys. Alright, so my E is here. Boink. Oh, nice. I hit it that. All right. Now my E should actually root if I can hit it twice or if Ash has them slowed. So Ash Seraphine is going to be really, really good lane, guys. Mana costs don't seem too high. They're about average, it looks like. Interesting. Nice, nice, nice. Actually, Ash actually did all that by herself. I'm still kind of getting used to how this uh, this plays. But yeah, you notice I don't even have to get, hit my E twice and ma make use of the passive to get the to get the root. So my E, it just goes straight through minions. I'm pretty sure, and it's just as long as Ash has hit them recently, it's just a root. Oh, oh. PB is a little wonky. Not not gonna lie. Alright, so let's try out my W. Boing boing. Wow! What in the world? Yo, that's like an ultimate ability, man. Did you guys see the range on that? Okay, okay Seraphine's kind of insane. Seraphine is kind of nuts. And then my ultimate, you guys are going to freak when you see the ultimate. Because look at the range of it. And the range gets extended if you hit an ally. I think we kill uh, Leona here. Yup, we do. We do. There we go, baby! Hit my Ash. The W. Oh, the, the W does have a really, really long cooldown, though. <gasps> what? That range is so long. Dude, her range is so long. Alright, if I can hit her with the empowered E into my Q, I think I kill her. Alright, I've got 1,100 gold. I'm going to go back and get... Uh, kind of want to kill, though. Yeah, for, first impression, these this champion's range is, like, kind of insane. Oh. Alright, we'll, we'll get used to landing those. I think I'm going to go back and get... Hmm. We definitely want a player in an AP... In an AP supporty way, but I think she's got such insane poke. I'm actually gonna go Sork Shoes. Cause I, I think my ultimate's gonna do like a lot, a lot of damage. But a hey, dishonest boss dr dropping the Twitch Prime. Thank you very much, man. Oh, she plays DDR when you uh press control one. 
Alright, the W has such a long cooldown. I don't think it's going to be like Sona E where you use it to get back to lane a little bit faster. But man, this W range is just massive, man. Alright, I, I got the hang of them. I'm going to be doing damage now, boys. Rooted. Dead. Very nice. The umbrella of your ash. Hey, thanks, man. I appreciate the one dollar, buddy. Oh, oh, I don't, I don't, I don't. <sighs> Rooted. Cute. Let's go, baby. Okay, seriously, this this lane is going to be really, really strong. No lie. The instant E root is just so good. What is going to separate good Seraphines from okay Seraphines is making good use of her uh, passive, though. Let's see how much my, my W heals are up. Okay, so it's not a massive heal. There's about 100, which will... That, that, that'll scale up as the game goes on. Okay, one thing is that you can actually harass them under their turret, like, pretty easily. Because my Q takes a long time to land, you kind of lob it like a Ziggs Q, like, you see that? So you can kind of harass them under turret without taking turret shots. Alright, I can't wait to show you guys the ulti. Just wait until you see this ulti, guys. Boing, boing. Slowing by 99%. Wow, even if it doesn't root, that's a 99% slow. That's a that's literally z zillion slow at max rank. And you get that at level 1. Yo, this champion's nuts. Yo, come, come, come and try me, bro. Come and try me. Okay, I changed my mind. I changed, I changed my mind. Woo, that's caustic damage. I would take the caustic with those with us though. I could have ulted, but I I haven't played her before, and I don't know how fast my ultimate comes out, and I didn't want to waste it. Alright, so for my items, guys, I think I'm gonna go for probably like a mage set. You know, let's let's go Leandri's or uh, uh Ludens. Ludens for this first game. And then we'll experiment with other builds, and you guys can let me know down in the comments what builds you guys want to see. Okay, so for my ultimate, it's called Encore. Seraphine takes the stage, projecting a captivating force that charms for 1.2 seconds and deals 207 magic damage. Any champion struck become part of the performance, extending the range. Allied champions gain maximum notes. Well, for each note, Seraphine's attacks gain attack range and a deal of additional magic damage. Okay, so she's got some like uh, magic damage pumped into her auto attacks. Yeah, this champion's going to be very, very strong in teamfights. She seems really pokey, brings some great utility to lane, but teamfights is where this champion's going to shine. Alright, so my ulti is 1.25 seconds. I'm just going to instantly alter. Mm-mm-mm-mm. Hit him with the poke. Hit him with the poke. Alright, there's her passive down. If they ever step out, we're going in. Oh my god. Rooted. Bye bye. We walk away with her ignite and still live. We take the. Oh my god. Oh, I missed my root. I think I'm dead. Yo, that Kha'Zix is fast. He's zooming, bro. He's zooming. What item does he have? I got lost chapter. She's really, really fun so far, by the way, guys. I like her.
Alright, let's see if we can get some more kills before Kha'Zix camps us a bit. Is she more fun than Sona? I know there's been a lot of comparisons to Sona. She actually is playing quite differently to Sona, if I'm being honest. Like, she's got a lot of surface level... Um... Comparisons. But I really don't feel like I'm playing Sona, really, at all. Sona's a little bit more like, uh... Not, not brainless, but brainless. You know, this has uh, all of her abilities or skill shots except for a W. I'm positioning differently. I'm looking for different plays. I really don't feel like she is Sona 2.0. Boing, boing. That Q is really fun to use. Once I get the hang of it, and I get the, the, get the hang time down, you know, we'll be good with that. I think I'm gonna max my W or yeah, it's gonna max my my E second. All right, Kha'Zix is top side. We just take this. We get our second dragon too. Oh, rooted. Hit him with the W. Hit him with the second W. Big ol' heal. Yeah, team fights. This champion's gonna be nuts, guys. She's gonna be unstoppable. If your Seraphine doesn't get straight one shot. Oh my god. Oh. Bro, what are you doing? Okay, my bad. I shouldn't have followed it. I also tried to use my E like Sona E. <laughs> it's our first game, guys. It's our first game with her. Once we once we start 5v5ing, I'm gonna pop. Okay, so your Q does make you stop. Your E does make you stop. Your W you can use without stopping. That's good. Her W would feel really, really clunky if you had to stop and use it. I'm on my way, fellas. I'm on my way. I've got my ulti if we can survive just a little bit longer. Just a little bit. No. She's dead. Is she? Oh, oh, Seraphine fight, baby. Let's go. Okay, okay, okay. We saved Dash. We turned the fight. We, we got the hang of this, boys. Yo, that, that W is seriously insane. O on God, guys. The W is really, really nuts. All right, let's get ourselves a dragon. Yeah, I think I'm going to go for a full AP build this game, guys. And then maybe next game we'll try out like a more healery build with like redemption and stuff. Nice. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm just maxing my Q, straight maxing it. How is Seraphine feeling? She's feeling great, man. Alright, I've got my Rudy up. Now, she actually is really fun. Shield, whenever Kha'Zix jumps in, just shield it. Clean, good job, good job. I got him rooted. I got him deaded. Okay, now we just peel ash. We just peel ash. Cue that over there. Boing, double kill. Wait, 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 wait. Triple, 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 triple. Shoot. Nice. Okay, I got the hang of it, guys. I am officially the rank one Seraphine now. Oh, 
Okay, I've got 2k gold though. I gotta go back and buy. I think I'm gonna go Zonia since we're playing against Fed Kha'Zix. Zonia's Hourglass. Grab that, grab that. Okay. I want to stick around my Ash. Yeah, like the laning felt pretty good. It was a little rough because I'd never used the skills before, so I was missing a lot, not getting like a lot of use or poke out of it, but team fights this champion really, really pops off. If you don't get one shot, and if you can stand in the back, like behind your front line, behind your Galio, behind your Vi, get those big long alties. Whew. And her ult can go a long way. Because champions uh straight extend it. Now that heal doesn't come out instantly. You gotta wait for the uh the second proc of it. The shield and the uh, the movement speed do though. All right, got my E. Wowzers. All right, well. They brought the team. <laughs> we kind of had a team fight with just us. All right, they uh, let's uh, let, let let's group up. If they're gonna group up, our Seraphine is way more fed than their Seraphine. That was a lot of people. All right, my next level, I get the tier two alt. Swap out this bad boy. Oh, get him, Trendamir! Get him, buddy! <clears throat> I would say her biggest weakness is just getting... She, she's immobile, so against champions like this, Kha'Zix, you know, you're always going to have problems. Oh, oh. Easy kill. Might be able to flash Rooter. But yeah, she's immobile, so she, you know if she gets blown up, she, she's not getting the peel. She's gonna get blown up, right? But she brings a lot to the table. She brings a ton of damage. She brings some pretty reliable CC like that right there. That's just a catch because of us. Like that's pretty crazy, and that's on a nine-second cooldown. It's really not that long. So a ton of utility, ton of CC, heal, peel, speed ups. I don't know. She's she's kind of like a lot of champions put together. She's got like I mean that 99% speed up. That's like the main reason people play Zillion, right? And you you get that at level one, a fully uh a fully leveled Zillion speed up. Okay, got three seconds on my alt. Just poke him, poke him. Hit him with the root. Oh, big, huge, guys. That ultimate is not okay. Rooted. Yeah, her ultimate's crazy. Rooted. Oh, oh, we turn it, we turn it. Oh, my God. Whoa. What? Wait, I'm seriously doing so much damage now, though. That ult reached the Nexus. Yo, my ult went so far. I'm telling you, if you could position correctly, like, behind your front line, your, your ult is crazy. It's a game changer, man. All right, let's go uh, Cosmic Drive. Hmm. Hmm. Cosmic drives. Dealing with damage with abilities grant 30% movement speed? Wait, that sounds pretty good, though. 
What do, what do you guys think we should be building for her uh, for a build right now? Let me know in Twitch chat and in the YouTube comment section if you're uh, watching on YouTube. We got that down to about 18 seconds. I'm on my way, homies. I'm on my way, homies. Big root. W. Poke. Oh. Yo. Hit him with the flash E, baby. Yo, sh guys. Okay. I'm, I might be in love. I might be in love. I got, I got my cosmic drive now. What is this called? Cosmic? Yeah, cosmic drive. Let's grab this. Head to Baron. So my W speed me up. Boom, boom. Boing. So yeah, that like I said, it's important to know that W heal does not come out instantly. It it kind it's kind of like a redemption where you cast it and then you the the shield and the speed does. The heal does not. It's kind of like a redemption. You have to wait for it to come down. Oh no! That was, that was just a good steal. That was just a good steal, boys. My bad, guys. All good. All good. Rooted. Dead. Godlike. Rooted. I got Lux. I got Lux. I got Lux. Oh my god. <laughs> this champion does way, so, way too much. Boys, 16 and 4. From humble beginnings. <laughs> He tried, man. He tried. Rooted. Dead. Yo. For real. 17 and 4 as, as Seraphine support. No lie, this champion's busted. This champion is Buku busted. Now, I did not play the early game very well, but hopefully you can forgive me. It's literally the first time anyone's ever played Seraphine. So, let's take a look at the, uh, the damage chart. And I want you to remember, when we see this damage chart... That we brought so much more to the table than just damage. We brought slows. We brought roots. We brought heals. CC. And yet. 31,000 damage from the support Seraphine. Guys. This champion's nuts. I really like her. I really, really like her. Let me know what you guys think about the build. Stratton champion down in the comments, boys. Take it easy. Peace. Uh, and remember to simp for Seraphine.